Hey boys, what is up? Welcome back to some more Beer Pro, where we uh, we had a we had a win, we had a win. So this is the third round of our NRL season, taking on the Raiders who are behind us in the ladder. So we're we're eleven spot overall, but we have had one, yeah, one loss, one win. So yeah, the season the season's got off to a to a solid start, not outstanding, but not terrible. You know, <laughs> one from two. You'd take that. I think most clubs would take that. Getting two, two losses definitely, uh, definitely not a good thing. But our first involvement here is from the kickoff, and we try to create a bit of room, and that's what I like to do. You know, you gotta, if they kick it to the wingers, always try to wrap around for like that, uh, the pass. But then right here, beautiful inside pass. I think it was Glenn Stewart, and we were straight through the gap, palmed off the fullback there. But the raid is covered up pretty nicely. And last tackle here. This is ridiculous. So Hodges picks it up. He is through. <laughs> he was through. He was going to be... He would have scored there. But then he passes back. And the, the dude he passed it to probably could have almost got to the try line as well. But then he fucking passed it to a dude that was marked. Um, we did get the penalty, but that was a bomb try. Um, and then right here, he passed it to me. I think I did call for it, so it's my fault. But thankfully, uh, we don't get tackled in goal. And we finally get a good opportunity to attack their line. Glenn Stewart, beautiful pass onto, I think it's Adam Blair. And Blair fucking passes it again. I don't know what the boys are doing this game, but they, they're they playing very unselfishly. I mean, I'll give them that, but they're just throwing the ball around like that. Um, <laughs> just open try line. It just bombs it. Um, terrible kick there by Milford, but it does come back to us, and we put in the grubber. Our kicking stat isn't good, so the grubber doesn't go anywhere. And we get tackled, tackled on last play there, but oh my goodness, we had so many opportunities this game. As you see here, we we stripped the ball, but that's pretty much two bomb tries gone begging. Um, like that second one was probably worse than the first one because it was a nice pass by Stewart and just Blair just, just palmed it off and totally blew it. But we get a nice offload away, bit of, bit of space there, but the Raiders, you know, they defended well. It's almost half time and... We really shouldn't have um, let it get to this. Well, we should have scored. That's pretty much it. And then right there, okay, so I was lining up for a field goal, but of course McCulloch goes the wrong way and doesn't pass to me when I need it. So, uh, But off the kickoff, we um, we make good ground. Bad chase by the Raiders and gets us in good field position. So good start to the second half. And then right fucking McCulloch did right there. I was lining up perfect 40-20 opportunity. Win going with us. And he passed it to Stewart. Um, that's a big hit coming in there from us, but Stewart thankfully passed it back to us pretty quickly. So we still got the kick away, but we just we couldn't get the 40-20. It was a perfect opportunity, but yeah, just sloppy play. McCulloch does that a lot in this series. But then Stewart right here through a gap, gets the p pass away, but Blake Austin comes up with the strip. This is a, we've had so many opportunities, but just nothing is going going our way to get over the try line, but. Right here, we feel this kick, and it just opens up. It just opens up. I don't know what the Raiders' defense was doing. I, I, I took, I, I attacked the ball, just a, a slight swerve to the left, and they just, they just scattered. They just scattered. I don't know what was going on, but, I mean, I'll take it. Nice, a nice length of the field try, almost 70 meters. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what they're doing. They just, <laughs> they just, yeah, poor play by the Raiders. But we finally get a try, a much deserved try. Uh, we played pretty good. We played really good this game. Our defense has been good, our attack, and that's the whole team has played well. It's just the final, the final passes, the final, the pass for the try has just gone begging on so many occasions. But I will say the one person that's like been exceptional for us is Glenn Stewart. Um, he's pretty much created like most of the chances, and um, just the outside men have, have not capitalized. But then right here. Uh, I don't get involved, and I let them do their thing, and they just throw an intercept, which I was not happy about at all. You know, 20 minutes to go, 6-0 up. I just wanted to, like, work it down to the end. We come up with a big tackle there, but, you know, this is the first real opportunity the Raiders have got this whole game. Our defense has been that good. But then right here, he gets the pass off to big Edric Lee, and he just, just powers his way over. Justin Hodges can't hold him up. He's going to reach out and score, so all of a sudden... All our good play for the game, it's pretty much gone. Our advantage is, is diminished. Uh, Croker does get that kick. I think come off the upright, but the Raiders here 
Now all of a sudden, the momentum has changed and they have all the running. Like, they're looking extremely dangerous. And then right here, we have to come up with a nice legs tackle, but he gets the pass away and Ray Thompson is going to raise one in score. If you, if you can't tell, uh, this game was extremely frustrating to play. <laughs> Look at them. They just stood there. He just runs straight through. Oh, just the AI. I'm really, you know, the one thing that's holding this game back from being like, just an amazing game is the AI. Especially in Beer Pro, the AI can be very, very annoying, but you know, we still have an opportunity. We still have a good chance to uh to win this game. That is not a good pass. <laughs> but thankfully we, we still come up with the ball and we we're almost straight through there, but a good tackle uh by the, the Raiders play there. But yeah we um ten minutes to go. I can't believe it's got to this. We <laughs> we played so good. Um yeah just terrible terrible stuff. And then right here, Thompson. I try to cut it off. Thompson shrugs me off. And then Hodges had him wrapped up. And he just broke the tackle. Ray Thompson is going to race away again for his second try. I mean, I like Ray Thompson as a player. I think he's he's very good. I think he's pretty underrated. But <laughs> I, don't, I don't think Ray Thompson would be doing that kind of effort. Um, so, yeah, this game is pretty much gone. It's, it's, it's over. Um, we are... Uh, yeah, very annoyed. Very annoying game to play. I was, I was not happy because, like I've been saying, pretty much the whole game we were, we were playing good. Our defense was solid. A couple of length of field tries by the Raiders, but then this footwork right here is just out of this world. But yeah, so many blown opportunities and then terrible, terrible one-on-one -on -one miss tackles, and leads to them getting a 12-point lead all of a sudden. <laughs> Four minutes to go. You know, if we score here, uh, we. We have the opportunity to to mount a slight comeback and put it into golden point, but I mean we've maybe we've used up our luck um, after a lot of the play here. But right here, so this is ridiculous. I, <laughs> for half of that, when I was running, I actually didn't realize I had the ball when I was playing this because it was a really nice offload by the forward here. I think it's Molo. Um, play here steps through. And then he gets the offload away, but then I think it's Molo here, passes straight off to me before he's tackled. I didn't actually realize I had the ball, so I was running around. Um, I shrug off one there, and then just, I finally realized, and I straightened up, big hole. The number 10 comes across. Well, I thought he was going to tackle me, but thankfully I got the ball down, so we, we score our second try. Ben Hunt will surely get this kick to make it 18-12 with a couple minutes to go. Uh, so... You know, we've done it before, but as I said, our luck might be running out in terms of comebacks in this game. We, we've had quite a few um, <laughs> pretty recently as well. So here we go. It's, it's do or die pretty much. Two minutes to go on the clock. This is our last set. And we try to attack straight away. And it's a good little opening stand. Um, the boys are actually throwing it around, but just couldn't get that pass away. It's going to be tough, man. It's really tough to score in this game um, at the best of times. And right there, okay. What I was going to do is, I was going to go for 40-20. It was pretty much perfect. I was 30 meters out. The wind was with us. But of course, McCulloch fucking passed it the wrong way. And I called for it, so obviously he passed it back to me. But I was tackled straight away. And yeah, that is going to be the game. So McCulloch screwed me over a lot in that game. <laughs> I felt if we got that 40-20, we could have won. But yeah, it was a big if. We might not have got the 40-20. So yeah, we got the man of the match. Of course, we were outstanding. Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.